Hey there, how are you doing on this beautiful summer day? Um, I know there's a little delay usually when live videos start, so I am just going to make sure everyone can hear me and see me. And um, I also found it interesting, I don't know if you notice any live videos. I hope my mic's working. If anybody can hear me or see me, type yes, you're good, or whatever in the comment section so I know that you can hear me. But if you've ever watched live videos, um, I am simplistic. Uh, looks like the connection is off a little bit. So that might sound very simplistic to you that you have to move your body, feel your body, and have the right frame of mind, but there's really a lot more into it. And um, I know this holds women back a lot of times on how to lose weight without deprivation, sacrifice, and basically white knuckling it through the whole process. And I get that you're worried that if you don't buckle down and you're not really rigid that you're never gonna lose the weight. Um, or if that you have to do something to make it through all the sacrificing, you're gonna gain all the weight back. And even worse is that you have to keep up this strict regiment that you've designed for the rest of your life, never to indulge in any of your favorite foods again. Intellectually, that makes sense. But here's the thing, when you put it into practice, you are setting yourself up for failure. So I wanna tell you a story about a comment that I saw on one of my posts uh, last week. But before I do that, if you're just joining us, I wanted to let you know I have an online program called Turn Your Life Around in Six. And if you're really serious about changing your weight and your life, head on over to shapeitupfitness.com slash call, C-A-L-L -L at the end. And just set up a quick phone call with me and I can tell you all about it. So last week, I saw a comment in one of my posts about a woman who stated she had a cheat day and then she was going to go back into strict mode. Um, I reached out to her. Uh, I was curious to find out what her plan was and what she was doing. Um, she did reply back and her plan was to do intermittent fasting with no cheat days. And when she reached her goal weight, she was going to start adding back in cheat days. Now, please do not think I am picking on this woman because I love that she has a plan. She sounds extremely determined, but she's setting herself up for failure. Uh, if you're gritting your teeth the whole time you're doing this, you're doing it wrong. This is the problem with all the conflicting diet and weight loss advice that's out there. There are so many options and opinions that it can be really extremely confusing. If she's using this extreme plan for a quick fix, that is exactly what she's going to get, a quick fix that is temporary. In order for this woman to be successful for the long term, she would need to white knuckle it for the rest of her life. And if she's falling off her cheat meals, my guess is she is not in the right frame of mind to lose the weight permanently. She is not alone. Uh, most women who come to me have done a ton of diets, a ton of weight loss programs, only to be left frustrated and feeling deceived. There is a simpler, easier way to do it. You really need to look at this as a long-term gig. This is not a short-term fix. I go through an in-depth process with all my clients because here's the other big thing. Everyone is different. What works for one person may not work for another, and this is why I customize all my clients' plans and programs. So if you want long-term success without being strict, start by looking at your current habits. So what are you doing with your time? How are you spending your days? What are you eating? Now, it's not necessarily about what you're eating, but maybe how much you're eating and why you're eating it. What are you thinking about when you think about losing weight? So all these um, daily activities and thoughts that you currently have, that is where they got you today. So what is one small thing that you can change today without going to the extremes? If you would like to share that one thing or if you have a question or you know would like a suggestion, um, but if you want to share that one thing that you think you might want to change, go ahead and put it in the comment section below. I would love to hear about it. And I do reply to all the comments, so feel free to comment below. So before I go, if anyone is really serious about losing weight, 
for life, not for a quick fix. Go check out Turn Your Life Around in Six over at shapeitupfitness.com slash call and jump on a call with me. All right, so thank you guys for watching. Remember to get fit, be fierce, and have no limits, and I will see you in the next Shape It Up video. Have a wonderful day. Bye.